Sadly, as much as I would love to outwit history, the experience that I had and the Yiddish that I learned um, and that Jewish experience is very difficult to duplicate. Um, my father did not want us to use English words if a Yiddish word were available. And I remember many years ago, um, we, were, we were probably in Boiberic, one of the last times I was there as a adu young adult with my parents. And we met a family who were friends of my father's. Their last name was Schechter. And I, 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 I believe that uh, Schecht, one of Schechter's son, son, sons-in-laws writes for the Pachentrager he translates. Um, he was an ultra-Yiddishist. And his little girl came over to him and asked him in Yiddish if she could have a lollipop. And she said to him in Yiddish, ich will a lollipop. And he said to her, this is a lekerl. It is a, a the, I guess, I never even heard the Yiddish word. I figured out to lek means to lick. He gave her the Yiddish word for it. And my father would do a similar thing. If there was a possible Yiddish word, he, he would prefer for us to use that. That was a very unique Yiddish experience to, to, to have that. Um, I think it's unduplicatable.